while that's doing its thing, it's turning into sauce. What we're going to do next is we're going to saute our eggplant so we can start setting up the eggplant lasagna. And the first thing we have to do before we start making the eggplant lasagna is we have to sweat our eggplants. So what you do is you cut them into slices and you just put salt on them and you let them sit there for at least 20 minutes and then you hose them off because that will release the bitter oil that's in the Italian eggplant. If you're using Ichiban eggplant, the purple ones, the narrow ones, you don't need to sweat them. But with the Italian ones you do. Be right back. We've got our eggplant. <laughs> it's ready to go. All right. Now the sauce isn't quite done, but what we're going to do is we're going to take a little bit of it and we're going to put it in the bottom of this because we don't want to burn the eggplant. So what we do, we just take just a bit and we're going to keep letting that cook down a bit. But we're just going to use this as the base. Just kind of wet it down a little bit. You know, you don't want it swimming in it, but you want it, you don't want it sticking either. All right, I'm going to put that back on there and let it keep doing its thing. And then we're going to do, we're going to start building our lasagna. So what we do, we take a layer of the eggplant. Then we go back to this, and mostly what we're after is the meat. Put a little bit on each one of these. There we go. We come back and we put another layer of the eggplant. It's eggplant lasagna is what it actually is. Yeah. And then I'm going to put a little bit more of the sauce on top, and then we're going to top it with cheese, and then we're going to put it in here, we're going to bake it. So, now you want more of the saucy stuff. There we go. All right. Set it up to bake. Try not to get my fingers. There you go. And I'm just going to put some cheese on top. Now, sometimes what I'll do is I'll make a bechamel, which is basically you take a roux, and then you, which is, for those of you who don't know what roux is, it's basically butter and flour, and then what you do is you put in some of the grated cheese into that, and you cook that into like a simple white sauce, and I'll top it with that, but because of the fact that I don't have a full kitchen to use today, we're just going to top it with the cheese. It'll still taste good, but I just like the bechamel better. This is the finale right here. Finished product. We've got the sauce bolognese on the easy cheesy gnocchis and we have our eggplant lasagna. This is mine. Keep your hands off. Okay. <laughs> See you next time on Man Cave Munchies.